hi there <clears throat> and welcome back so i've been lucky enough to be asked uh to do an unboxing again uh from your creative studio so it's just arrived uh this morning which is monday i think you'll see this on wednesday so we'll just open it up i don't know what which month it is I feel like I'm a bit out of the out of the loop. Um, I've not seen many um, your creative studio box unboxings for a while. The bluebird carries the sky on his back. I like that. Oh, hopefully it'll be all birds and things. That'll be nice. So let's let's have a look. But I'm gonna lift everything out and just do it on the on the tissue so what have we what have we got oh i enjoyed those last time the different ones but um oh this looks super yeah jam packed again oh there's two things there oh look at all those oh oh fab Okay, so let's leave um, the actual Your Creative Studio things till last. So that's things that they've actually uh, designed themselves. And we'll have a look at, at these first. So these strips I found very, very handy. They're just little washy uh, strips. That will go my uh, Trash Tuesday. Very, very nice. So we've got lots of just little ripped off uh, strips of like washi tape. And so they come in brilliantly. And you get absolutely loads. I think it looks like there's two of each. All different uh, sepia tones which suits me down to the ground. Yeah, loads there. I don't know if it says 50. So 50 uh, pieces of washi strips. I normally have those like just hanging about uh, on my desk because um, they are very handy. So I've got some tickets. And these are all the same and they're like a, a bluey uh, grey colour I really do like that colour and I love making uh, ticket snippets so they will definitely come in handy I would say there's probably 50 uh, there let's have a look at this so more of those uh, little pieces of paper which I love I've done a few uh, projects which are coming up um, shortly with these types of, of papers normally get two of each but it looks as if they're just single ones so yeah lots of different uh, colours great if you are doing you know neutral collage um, I don't have a lot of like vintage books and and things so this is brilliant to give me lots of different looks so yeah these uh doubles of some of them but they're a different color which is brilliant oh and then we've got some different shaped ones so i mean you can make these into tags and just put a botanical on or something uh, like that so loads of those and then a bigger size these would be perfect journal size card uh, size yeah i think i'll keep these for journal cards yeah nice nice mix i like how these are full full letters shrunk down Yeah, fabulous. I would say there's 50 in there. I don't know if it, if it sounds. Hmm. 
No, I can't say. No, but I'd say there's a good, good 50 there. Again, that'll go in my uh, Trash Tuesday pile. Oh, this is interesting. Oh, I like this. So, these uh, rip off, they've got the perforations on. I've got a little butterfly in a stamp. That's a little tit. Um, on some grasses and a fern and a butterfly and then a swallow and a stamp and then we've got this this big one all the same yeah so I'll be able to pop some of those in in happy mail and stuff but yeah I'll definitely uh, be able to use use those and I think they'd probably be really good to, to tea dye as well so I think I'll rip a couple off actually. Well, I think about it. Look, because I'm tea staining at the moment and just try uh, tea staining those. So I've got a packet of stamps here. Again, nice, nice backing. Oh, these are all, all butterflies, looks like, yeah. Oh, nice. So, yeah, won't have to do uh, much to that to, to change it. So, I've got some butterfly stickers. It looks like we've got two of, two of each. Nice different colours. I love the brown ones. I like how some of them have got the actual uh, postage stamp on. Yeah, lots of these. Probably about 50 again. Yeah, very good colour um, differences. With the other one is to that, like the green and the blue. Oh, them two, I'm guessing it's in there somewhere. So that's those ones. Oh, this looks very interesting. Don't know what it is. Looks as if it's some kind of envelope. Let's have a look. So, what's this? This is. I wonder if these things really go in inside and then it's folded up and you can tie it uh, round. I have to think how I can use that. I mean, it's an instant pocket, isn't it, really? Let's see what I've got in here. So these look like just papers, really nice uh, feel to those papers. And they've got like blues and browns and, and greys. That looks like a, a gauge. Christmas exhibition. Yeah, these are nice papers. A map. And we've got some stickers. These are the washy ones. They look white, but then when you put them on, uh, they see through. It's a little book. It's like a little collage. Oh, they're cute. Little tags. That's a little tag. An envelope tag. Um, postcard. Oh, that's nice. And we've got a radio, which is a bit strange. <laughs> little uh, brass birdie. Home sweet home. Um, a, a looking glass. Little clip. Alarm clock, oh, another alarm clock. Oh, the look of that record player. Some like tins. Another like collage piece. And another collage piece. 
and we've got some stacks of papers. I think these are um, not stickers, so I would cut uh, around those to get the, the white off. I do like those. Then, I'm not sure if this is a whole like, sticker page. Must be. I think it is a sticker. But you must cut these out individual. Vintage scene creator. Ooh, I like these little bits of paper. And then these are that nice paper again. Very nice paper. And some little labely type things. Yeah, not a bad little uh, set. Some of it a bit random, but I'm, I'm liking this green and uh, the neutrals. Very, very nice. So, yeah, it's a very neutral uh, pack so far, which, you know, suits me down to the ground. So, let's have a look at uh, the things that were actually created by your creative studio. So, this is their washi tape. And obviously their theme is birds. Can I find the end? So we've got some pretty pink flowers, a bird, some blue birds, and then it just, just oh the butterfly. And then I think it starts repeating. Oh no, it's still not repeated. Mm, goes on and on. <laughs> so it's very, very nice washi tape <clears throat> from your creative studio. Very sticky. A bit like Tim Holtz sticky. And um, yeah, they do lovely washi and uh, stamps. I've always been very uh, happy with the stamps. Okay, we'll pop that there. So these are the, the stamps. Let's have a look. I like how they come in their own little uh, pouch. Oh. So we've got three birds all in different positions. And then we've got some berries and leaves. Some berries, a couple of leaves. And then they look like uh, acorn type things. So yeah, they're really nice. Yeah, I don't have a lot of bird stamps, so I'm chuffed about those. I'll take the paper out and put that in my um, trash. Yeah, super. So that's that. <clears throat> and then we've got these ooh, little ephemera pieces. I don't know if they're stickers or if they're just paper. Oh no, they're stickers. So we've got some pink roses, <coughs> some little birds, more pink flowers, some more birds. I think it looks like you get three. Three of each, some birds and, and blossom. These are go nice with the, the kit that Denise from Junk Journals Junket um, has been doing a blossom kit. Some little berries. I think I'll save this till till next spring. It's very spring uh, line. Look at that. Oh, with the butterflies and birds. Oh, it's the same as that one. We've got Kingfisher. <coughs> Another bird. They're the birds on the stamps, aren't they? And then these lovely berries. And there's more. <laughs> Kingfisher again on its own. Another bird. <coughs> I've got 
want some butterflies. Another different butterfly and then some more birds. Yeah, they're beautiful. Very, very nice. <clears throat> so that's that and I shall keep the, the card in the junk. And I'm guessing this is like a notepad. They, they normally have like a, a sticky notepad or... Oh, it's a little book. Oh, look at this. Oh, this is lovely. So these are all, all these, but big. So three of each. Oh, that's beautiful. Love that, that dusky purple with the blue. Yeah, these are lovely. Great for collage. Obviously, you can make small uh, journal cards. That's very nice. You can rip, rip around them. Oh. That's nice back end. And the next one now. Oh, beautiful green. And that one. That one. That one. Yeah, I do like that green with the pink. Oh. That one. Oh, that's nice. It's all quite scratchy. Hey, it looks really vintage and that so yeah and then you could turn that into a little book after yeah very very nice I like that so that's that and last we've, oh no I've got some of their um, stickers I normally put these on um, when I send the patron happy mail out I normally put those on on the front of of there because they stick really nice and then we've got um some tissue i don't know if it's just one piece or a couple of pieces but yes i'm going to put these away uh for spring oh yeah i think there's four look five beautiful so that is i couldn't tell you what month it is um I don't know if I know she was running behind on them at, at some point. I don't know if uh, you know she's now caught up or or not. But I don't think I've seen uh, this one. But like I said, I've not seen um, no unboxing videos for ages. So this is your creative studio. It's very similar to what you get each month. It's just you know different different themes, um, and I I love this one. So thank you very much, Amanda, for sending me this box. And um, yeah, when I use it, I shall definitely give you a shout out. So thanks for watching and I shall see you all very soon. Bye for now.